and you have a dual camera setup on top. Now, this camera setup, I felt like at that time, was like pretty average. I didn't think it was going to be like as good as the S10, but for a majority of things that I did and for all of the tests that I've done throughout the life cycle of this device, I saw that this camera is actually really, really decent. It has a 12 megapixel wide angle lens and then a 16 megapixel ultra wide sensor. And I think the biggest thing that made me think that this phone wasn't going to be as good as the S10 was mostly because of the lack of telephoto lens. But first of all, I never really use a telephoto lens that much, it doesn't matter. But also, visually, when you look at a phone that has three cameras over two cameras, you just assume that it's just not as good. Oh, the other one is better because of the extra sensor. But for 99% of the things you're going to do, you're just going to go take the photo, maybe zoom in, and then just click it. Like, you're not really overthinking it. And I feel like these manufacturers spend a lot of time talking about the cameras when they're doing their keynotes and stuff. For, I like, almost everyone I know, they're usually just either making Snapchat videos or, like, TikToks or sending a message to somebody. Like, they don't really like need to think about the photo and make it the best quality they just want to go tap it and move on and this camera i think does it very well the ui is pretty good you know you have a lot of features built into the camera as well you have portrait mode on this thing you have a lot of different features and with one ui 2.5 it brought even more features into this camera which is really awesome and like i said before anytime we get new features in the software that is always one of my favorite things to look about and just gush over so for sure this camera on this phone is very good in my opinion and like i said i don't all those comparisons before those camera comparisons and i saw that the s10 e camera in my opinion was probably better than a lot of those other cameras on the front you have a 10 megapixel wide angle lens you can do 4k at 60 on this front facing camera as well which is awesome so for sure when it comes down to this camera i love it i think it's great and for a phone that's you know over a year old i think it holds up extremely well especially for a budget device of last year this phone wasn't necessarily the flagship and the fact that it has this good of a camera gets a thumbs up for me in my books now zooming out of the camera <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>